Today's topic is how to properly adjust your steering sensitivity. For those of you that don't know how to get to steering sensitivity on a Gen 4 system, it's pretty simple. Uh, you click on your menus tab in the bottom right corner, applications, auto track guidance tab, and from here you can click on this steering. That'll bring you to your op steering optimizations tab. Uh, this is the one that we're going to be talking about here, steering sensitivity. Uh, default setting for this is 70. Uh, this setting changes the aggressiveness of the auto steer system uh, or how hard the system is going to work to acquire and hold your guidance line. This does not mean that putting the setting to the max or 200 is going to give you the most accurate auto track line. Uh, typically higher steering sensitivity is used in more aggressive steering conditions like driving through a lot of ditches or uh, tractors that will be using a three-point mounted planter or other implements that have a heavy draft load. On the other end of this subject uh, is when you would have a lower steering sensitivity. Typically a lower steering sensitivity is used in less aggressive steering conditions with low draft loads and higher speeds such as hitch drawn implements like discs and cultivators. If the steering sensitivity is too low, a slow wandering track error will occur on the display. Uh, you can see that right here. Uh, you'll see it wandering back and forth. Uh, typically a low sensitivity is when the machine tracks from side to side in a matter of about 10 seconds. Uh, so it'll track from the left, it'll be about 2 inches off to the left. 10 seconds later it'll track two, 2 inches off to the right. And I'll just wander back and forth slowly like that. Uh, if this occurs, uh, increase the sensitivity until the desired accuracy is achieved. So coming here, up it by five. Uh, you want to do small increments until the desired accuracy is achieved. Uh, and like I said earlier, uh, more aggressive setting does not make your system more accurate. It will cause the system to uh, have excess wheel movement and excess wear in the front steering system uh, like the tie rods, axles, pivot pins, wheel bearings, etc. Uh, steering sensitivity is considered too high if the back and forth wheel motion occurs about every second. Uh, lower the sensitivity in increments of 5 until there is no longer uh, excess wheel movement. Uh, you gotta do this but not to go too far that your machine starts to wander back and forth uh, it's all about finding that sweet spot depending on the job or the work that you are doing.